How many days does it take for them to get, let's say, from the Chicago region down to Mexico? The peak of the migration here is in the first half of September, and they really start getting to Mexico in early November. Do we have any idea of how far they fly during the course of a day? Or This is something we're just starting to find more about. So the way we, the way we knew that it was the same for a long time, that it was the same butterflies making the whole trip, uh, is through tagging. And the way tagging works is uh, the tags are little uh, bits of paper with adhesive on one side and data on the other. They're about the size of a paper punch. And they're affixed to the middle of the hind wing of the monarch. And they stay on and doesn't seem to interfere with the butterflies flying. They're released and, and off they go. Well, monarchs that have been tagged in Canada have been recovered in Mexico. So the only way that that's going to have happened is if the same butterfly was able to make the entire trip.